Okay, this video will show how to change your ship in Starbound, regardless of what race your character is. So for this example, I have this character, which is uh, Moth People, we'll say, because I can't really pronounce that. I can't be bothered to. Anyways, maybe you like this one, but the ship is the same as the glitch ship, and maybe you don't like that. So maybe you want to change it to, let's say, the Nova Kid ship. Well, I have a fully built Nova Kid ship on another character. They're going to transfer over to this character. I'm going to show how to do that. So let's go take a look at the Nova Kid. So we have Juice here. I've spent quite a bit of time on this ship. As you can see, it's upgraded quite, quite a ways, decorated. Of course, it's using the FMU mod. We have automated farming going on here already. I have some things in the cabinets, tenants. So all of this should be transferred over. The only thing that won't transfer over to the other character is the crew. So we'll see how to do that now. So just to avoid any glitches, I don't know if this is really necessary, but on Syrup, which is the moth character, we will use an admin command just to make sure the ship is past the point where the FTL drive is upgraded. So to do that, we're just going to type admin. Oh, admin taken away. Admin. Then I think it is upgrade ship. Three. Nope, that didn't work. Okay, it took a lot of tries, but I got the right command. I'm going to upgrade the ship to hopefully the same level as the Nova Kid ship, just to avoid any glitches. I don't know if that's really necessary, but we're going to do that. Spawn item, ship, T4. We'll try that first. Get a thing and we click that. Okay, we've had an upgrade. So this is just one above getting the drive fixed. That's uh, ship T3 would be just with the working FTL drive. So let's scale it up now. Instead of ship T4, we'll do ship T7, I believe the Nova Kid ship is. Okay, let's hit that. There we are. There we go. Basically the same as a glitch ship, just with nicer windows. So. I do like being able to fly. So we can move around here like that, but we better to be safe just hang around close to the teleporter, which is mostly in the same place. So now we just save and quit. And we'll tab over into the player folder. So if you're not sure how to find this, just pause the video and look at the path here. Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Starbound, Storage, Player. This looks like a mess of numbers. I'm just going to go back and refresh it. But you'll notice if we sort by date modified, the most recent one, most recent files have a player and ship world files. These are related to Syrup, the moth character we just had. Just a little bit earlier, we have player files and a ship world file. 
Now the ship world file is the one we want to change. That should be for Juice, the Nova Kid. You notice all these files are probably related. They have the same number string. So that's how we know it's the same player. Well, these are not. But we have only one ship world, so that's how we avoid confusion. So I've backed this up already. So we will copy this. I have the copy right here. Then we'll take the name of the ship world because we want the game to think that this is the file it's accessing. So we'll just copy the exact string of numbers. Now that's done. We'll delete that ship world. Then we'll go to the copied one and paste that. Okay. So that should be done. Let's give it a try. So we'll click on syrup again. And there we are. The entire ship is exactly how it was on juice. All the plants are here, the robots are here, and uh, apparently I was wrong, the crew stayed. But they don't like me. They're not showing as my crew members, so I can't use them. They'll just be here wandering around. You can talk to them, interact with them, but they won't act like crew. Plants are here, the fruit's here, even the drinks are in the cupboard. Everything's the same right down to the tenants. Now let's give it a try and see if the ship can fly. Have a little bit of fuel in there even. Yep, and we're moving. Everything works as normal. Storage locker works. Sail window comes up as this race, but it looks like the Nova Kid one. I have one in the inventory of my race, so I'll see if I can. Now it won't let me tear it off. So we're stuck with that. That's okay. Beam down. Just as a quick test. And it works. Beam up. All the same. Right? Thanks for watching.